Mr. Perfect is absolutely adorable. Look at his neat hair and his little eyes. He's so cute. The story itself is quite interesting because there's not really a moral or a message. And I don't think it's that funny either. Whereas a lot of the books I think are great for encouraging children to like literature and to get them engaged in reading. That's not so bad if there's no moral or message. But with this one, I feel like there's no moral. There's no message. It's not funny and it's not quirky. So I honestly don't know what there is in this to appeal to young children very much compared to other books. Nevertheless, it is very well illustrated, so it's quite nice to look at. We learn that Mr. Perfect is having a birthday and all of the characters come together to bring him presents. But unfortunately, things don't go perfectly. Mr. Uppity causes a bit of a problem. He grumbles about everything. Um, Mr. Greedy eats the cake. Mr. Clumsy smashes the plates. And Mr. Perfect is fine with everything. He finds a solution to all of the problems. He just has one cake for himself. They look rather delectable. And Mr. Uppity finally loses his cool and snaps and tells him that your fault is that you have no faults. Now I'm trying to think here, is the message that there is, a, there is a solution for everything? The plates break? Use cardboard plates. The cake's eaten all by Mr. Greedy? Well, you probably shouldn't have had that much cake yourself anyway. Is it about having a sunny disposition, a positive outlook? Finding that perfection is simply having a solution to every problem so that there are, in theory, no problems. I feel like that's getting a little bit too complicated for the target audience. I feel like the message, well, I'm clutching at straws trying to find that message. And as I said, there's nothing particularly funny about it or entertaining or silly. Maybe Mr. Greedy eating all of the cakes. But compared to other Mr. Men books that are narrative driven rather than driven by a message or a moral, it just doesn't seem to have anything. That's not to say it's not a good story, but comparative to the rest, it just seems to be lacking something.